Welcome back to another video. I'm over here in Jessalo Beach and uh, I'm gonna be playing nine holes. Uh, this was a really nice course. Uh, it's a little warm, but uh, we have a nice uh, breeze coming from the, from the sea, the Adriatic Sea. So I'm gonna play nine holes. This one right here is uh, par four. It's 322 yards. Um, I'm gonna play my three wood because I don't wanna really start with a driver and get into trouble right away. So it seems like it's pretty straightforward just a little bit to the right of the bunker and then uh, go from there. Okay, that was pretty good. Okay, so I went to the right, maybe a little bit too much to the right, but it should be in the fairway. Okay, so there's the bunker and I got it to, to the right of it. So it was a really, really good shot here. I'm gonna how much left I have here okay so that was a really safe shot I think that's good that I hit a three wood and the wind kind of caught it so it went a little farther got about 110 to the flag but it's into the wind so I think I'm gonna play my pitching wedge okay definitely got the wind and I faded so that's pretty good very very nice that was a great shot uh it kind of uh faded a little bit here but it was pretty good i got this for birdie now so hopefully i can convert it oh perfect speed though and that's an easy par and uh there uh, what i'm doing is i'm practicing that short uh stroke right there it's working really good so okay Let's move on to the next hole. This next one is uh, part three, 150 yards, but uh, it's against the wind. So um, it's gonna be a tough one. I normally play a seven iron for 150. So I don't know if I should play two clubs or just go with, uh, with a six iron. Um, I think I'm gonna go with a six iron and then try to play it a little bit to the right of the green. Okay, that went pretty good actually, should avoid the bunkers. And I think it made it. Hopefully it didn't pass it, but it was a good strike. Okay, so I avoided the bunker and it went to the right of the hole. And I think that's pretty good. Um, I used the right club. I didn't want to go long either, but it caught the wind. So now I have a birdie pot from here. Oh no, that was bad. I needed to give it a little more. That was pretty bad. So now I got this for par. It was a little uphill. I needed to hit it a little more. Oh. Unlucky, so that was an unforced error. Unforced error, I, I. Okay, so this next hole is a long par four, it's 400 yards, 420 yards actually. So I kind of regret missing that part because this one right here uh, is very likely that I'm gonna probably, I'll probably be happy with a buggy. It's against the wind and it's 420 yards. Um, I haven't been striking my driver very good, so I'm just gonna stick with my three wood and try to see if I can make it to the green in two. Okay, that was great. Little draw to the left side. Got a little bit of roll, so hopefully I can have a good uh, second shot from there to the green. Okay, so the tee shot was pretty good on the little bit of the left side, but I still have a while. I have a uh, 210 to the flag and it's a little bit against the wind, so I see a little bunker to the right, so I think if I stayed on the left side, I should be good. I'll just use my three wood. Oh, kind of slipped there. So I went to the right, but it's before the bunker, so I should be okay. Yeah, that wasn't the greatest swing there. Okay, so I got a tricky shot from here. Uh, it happens to me every time. Every time I'm hitting against the wind, I try to accelerate too much and then I come a little bit over the top. 
Um, it's a little tricky because I have to get over the bunker and there isn't much uh, green to work with. So I normally don't use my 60, but I think I'm gonna have to. Okay, so I got my 60 here. That's why I want it to be on that side. So mistakes like this can cost you. So just try to pop it up in the, in the air with a 60. Hopefully it will check. I just have to commit to this shot. Okay, I committed to it, but yeah, it's too much. I should be, hopefully I can two part from there. Okay, so I have a really long putt. Uh, there wasn't much I could have done from there, I guess. I had to play it a little shorter. And it's a little uphill, so that's the only good thing, but it's quite long. I'm happy with a two part here for bogey. So, gonna try to use my technique. Okay, it looks pretty good. I just read it a little bit too much to the right. It's actually perfect. Okay, so I'll take the bogey and I'm two over now, so. It's okay, I think uh, it, was it was really important for me to play to the right, to the left of the bunker, and that way from there, it, it would be much easier than from there, so. But that's okay, let's go to the next hole. So this next one is a par four, uh, 360 yards, I think. Uh, the only problem, there's some water, so you don't wanna go too long and you wanna stay a little bit to the right. Uh, I'm gonna play my three wood. I'm just gonna stick with my three wood for now. Okay, so actually uh, I've seen people trying to find the balls in the water, so I'm gonna go with a four iron. Um, that way, uh, because it's a little bit uh, into the wind, so if I play a three wood and if I hit it really well, it might go into the water. So just slightly to the, to the right here, because the green actually goes that way. So just, try, I'm gonna, just gonna try to make it play safe. Four iron. Okay, that's okay, should be okay. It's in the fairway to the right. I don't know how far from the green that is, but that's better than uh, hitting a three wood and getting into the water, so. Okay, so here's my ball. It was definitely the right play because I could have risked going into that with a three wood. I'm still a little far back. The green is there, but at least I'm in play. I have 180 yards, uh, it's into the wind. And I think I'm just gonna use my four iron because I don't think I'm gonna, normally I don't hit this very well. Um, so I'm gonna try to, actually, actually I'm gonna play my five iron just to make sure. Okay, so I grab my five iron because with the five, I know I can hit 170, uh, 75 maybe. So 180 with the wind, I should definitely get there, so. I pushed it, I wasn't, I didn't commit to the shot there. Definitely did not commit to it, so. I pushed it to the right, and I hit it off the toe, so. I think, to be honest there, I need to hit a six iron, but I need to hit it fully committed, so. All right, that's okay. So here's my ball, and it's been high to the flag right there. That just shows you that that was the wrong club to play because I think even a seven iron would have been better. It was into the wind. So mentally, I kind of like slow down my swing and I push it to the right. And with the five iron hitting it off the toe, I almost made it. So that would have been completely wrong. It would have been in the woods past the green. So make your mistake there. Now I'm going to try to make it, try to get it up and down from here. Okay, so I have this to save par. Slightly downhill, not the kind of part I want actually, but uh, just have to barely touch it. It is makeable, but I have to play really, really soft. Just slightly tap it. Oh, 
pull no just played it too hard it was perfect line but I just played it too hard so this is for bogey yeah so that good that takes me to three over and basically it was all force errors but uh, it's okay let's go to the next one three over okay so this next one is a par four about 340 yards a uh, little trouble to the right and left I'm just gonna keep going with my three wood uh, I feel like I really need to get a birdie now because uh, I, I'm three over so I don't know if this is the hole for birdie but uh, at least no more bogeys okay that was a little bit of a fade and stay a little short yeah because it kind of cut to the wind the wind is blowing from right to left so it kind of went like this so that's short it's going to be a long second shot now i think maybe on this one it was better to do a driver so i can pass all the trouble but okay so actually it wasn't bad at all it was actually pretty good i have 143 to the flag a little wind against just slightly from right to left um, 143 I think I'm gonna go with my eight iron I don't want to pass it so and I think the bunkers are way short there so just try to hit a good eight iron okay right straight to it hopefully it's the right club yeah just a little short I think I didn't quite catch it well but uh, it's in the green so it'll be okay Okay, so actually it's not, it didn't make it to the green, but uh, I don't really want to pass it. So hopefully I can get this up and down. I'm gonna use my 52. It looks like it's pretty straightforward. So very slightly to the left, I think. Just gonna try to keep it low. Looks like a lot like my backyard here. So hopefully. A little too much to the left uh, that's okay okay so I have this for par had to play just a little bit more to the to the right actually so okay good I really needed to get that part because I was feeling like I was getting off the, of the you know, I was just getting three bogeys in a row. So that felt good. Let me go to the next hole. 